I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, I'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system. Same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me. Even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. And for a moment, I feel whole. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So! What are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight. Both, actually, but, um... I, I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you. No matter what, you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information 
on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Shall we? Scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. Grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. <coughs> Some of the blight is it's peeling off. Dead skin. Is that how it spreads? Yeah. Those ruins. That's where we need to go. A few ways down. What are we after exactly? The backup? Well, um, it's an AI. It's, um, it's hard to explain. Think of it like a set of instructions that can fix the world. Sounds complicated. I don't know how to put these ropes here, but we can use the line to slide down. Yeah, I, um, ran into some trouble on the way here. Lost a lot of my gear. Looks like they left a carcass behind. A lot of arrows in that machine. Better take a closer look. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. There's some ridgewood by the stream. All right. Now to craft some arrows. Done. Me too. 
Arrows ready. There's a ladder. But can't reach it from here. Nothing a well-placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. After you. By the goddess. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission... The, uh, message I found. Didn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. So, um... What happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You were right about that. We should find another way. Down this way. Get to the cross. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Give it a second. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Okay, concentrate. Anything good? A few supplies. data on the machine like a hunter studying its prey yeah kind of so after the fuss over me leaving what did everyone else do well as soon as the celebration was over my mother led the rest of the Nora home got it people who work rebuilding the city I said I have to find you Yeah, I found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. It's good to have extras. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but... Why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them. I should be able to pry this open. There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above.
Whoever left this here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Ugh, what's that stench? The entire camp. I doubt. They must have come here to delve for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. And then through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. <laughs> it's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Poor guy. Acid burned right through his armor. Part of a machine could help fix the gears. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. Caster. Now to test it on the debris. Not even a dent. But maybe the pole caster can take out the debris. I thought. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. What's this? Huh. What's this thing for? Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. Wonder what's in this auditorium. Guess we'll find out.
Any luck? Not yet. But scanning the area with my focus activated might show me something. Wow, that works. That pull caster's useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. sapiens us we have always pushed the boundary as explorers pioneers trailblazers and now far zenith is taking the next leap into the future that's why we're proud to have resurrected the odyssey when our governments abandoned in orbit far zenith will actualize in less than a decade but that's only the beginning when the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. The Sirius system. There, we'll create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it. But when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimvumbe, the truest form of immortality is data corrupt. The playback stopped. The old ones could... I still can't believe the old ones could fly. They were capable of a lot of things. For good and bad. Sure seems like it. I wonder what it's like up there, among the stars. My focus might be able to help here. Show off.
should be able to pull that thing out of the wall. Deeper into the creepy ruin we go. Keep your guard up. Oh, my guard is up. <coughs> up here. <laughs> Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. <laughs> you take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. Closer. And stay out of sight. been meaning to mention. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry my whiskers offend you. They used explosives anointed. against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. This for later. 
Guess that Osram didn't have a chance to use it. Careful. Traps ahead. Huh. We might be able to disarm them. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. And not blow it. yourself up. And got more supplies. Looks like another camp. While we're here, if we can make some traps on our own. Might come in handy if we got machines. I need to craft a trap. There. Explosive trap made. If anything walks into one of those, it won't know what hit it. Over here. Aloy. I think I see a way up. Going then. You've been in a lot of old world ruins. Are they all like this? They all have their secrets, but every place is different. storm picking up out there. Yeah. And they're getting stronger. And more frequent. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yeah. But I can only do it if I find that backup. I think we're winding our way around to the data center. We need to cut through that big building on the right out there. Looks like we've got to climb up. You OK? 
okay? Yeah. Guess we won't be going that way. Thousand years old. Looks like some kind of meeting room. That door on the other side's locked. Onzu. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. The brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Paul. We look alike because we're the exact same. Genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made. By a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup? is like a set of instructions. It's more than that. It's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the Goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this... Gaia? Yes, but... She's not the Goddess, Oral. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus, but for now... The report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Huh. Look at that. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. A weapon. Thanks, Varl. We should keep moving. After you. Down here. I think we're almost back outside. Good. <laughs> 